Hey guys, Nika Naturally. So I'm doing my wash regimen today and I wanted to share it with you. My hair is wet already because I did wash it. I'll show you what I used and what I did. I started off with my hair braided like this. I wore it under a hat yesterday, um, so I just left the braids in. Normally I do big twists, but since the braids were there, I just left those. And it actually worked better with the braids because the twists tend to unravel if you do them too big. So this worked out. I um, shampooed my hair just like this with Herbal Essences Hello Hydration. And I used the pads in my finger to massage it into each section, got the parts and everything. I rinsed that out and I used Hello Hydration, the conditioner. I put that on and left it on while I actually showered. And then I rinsed the conditioner out with cool water. And um, now what I'll be doing is using for the first time Kinky Curly Not Today. And I'll show you the remainder of my process. I will be using the Denman. And I must warn you now, since it is winter time, my hair sheds severely. So you don't throw your Denman away and thinking it's ripping my hair out. It's actually my hair just shedding really bad. So, thankfully I have a lot to um, be able to spare because otherwise I'd really be panicking. It is a lot of hair that's been coming out. So, let's see. I'll use a good amount for each section. I'll start off with this. I start at the tips so that I don't rip any unnecessary hair out. I'm going to put a little more. Prior to this kinky curly, I was using mixed chips as a leave-in. And I really like that because it's very thick. So now what I'm going to do is each braid, I'll put that into two or three twists. And I'll try to do it a little neater so that maybe I can do a pin-up hairstyle or something. I won't have to just wear hats until I actually do a style or whatever. Maybe this can be my style. I'm trying to smooth the hair down to make sure the flyaways are coated and keep them at bay as best I can. I really should have deep conditioned today, but... I did. Okay, I'm back. I decided to show you this whole last section so that you could see exactly how the kinky curly coated my hair. I didn't give a close up. So, here we go. for all the lost hair. Thank you. So far I think I like the kinky curly but I'm pretty sure I like mixed chicks better just because it is thicker and with my hair I need it's really dry and because it's so thick I need a really heavy product. And this would be my next but this is pretty thick, so we'll see tomorrow. Once my hair dries, yes, it'll take till about tomorrow for it to air dry.
hours later, and clearly these aren't the same twist I left with. I was sitting on the couch and I just, for whatever reason, started going back through making the twist smaller. So I unraveled each twist and took the two pieces and made that too. And I've basically just been doing the top and anything I've missed I'll go back through in the middle or the bottom and do it but for the most part I think I did a, all the surrounding edges in the top so it's not as noticeable. At least I don't think so. I hadn't looked in the back so it might be. We'll see. So these twists are going to last longer than I'd planned because I just keep making them smaller and smaller. And I usually take the front twist and I'll twist it the opposite way of the rest so that it's kind of pulled up out of my face. So instead of twisting this way like I did the rest, I'll twist it reverse. Kind of sucks. I'm trying to stay protective, but this is probably going to make a really good twist out. So I guess I'll wear it for maybe a day or two and not pull the twist apart too much. Just pull the two pieces apart and leave it at that. And it shouldn't be too much maneuvering. So it shouldn't be too bad. And I have not put anything else on the twist other than the knot today. Usually I do twists with uh, coconut oil, but I'll go back later and put something on them. You can see some of them are still thick, but uh, I'll worry about those later. All right, guys, thanks for watching.